Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we are going to fix the entry point not found error that many Windows 11 users face. In this video, I am going to walk you through some simple steps to fix this issue. So without taking much more time, let's get started. Here I will show you two fixes that have proved beneficial to many Windows users. Okay. So my first method would be system file checker scan. Windows has a built-in tool called System File Checker or SFC that can scan for and fix corrupted system files which might include the missing DL. Okay. So let's activate this helpful tool. So for that first click on the start menu and type command prompt. Right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator. Once the command prompt windows will open here you need to type sfc space front slash scan now and press enter sfc will now scan your system files for error and corrupt files this procedure may take some time so please be patient and wait for the scan to finish This can sometimes fix any corrupted or missing files associated with the program. So uh, after that restart your computer and try again to see if the entry point not found error has been fixed. Okay. So if you are still getting the entry point not found error, please try the next solution which would be reinstall Microsoft Visual C++ redistributable package. Actually this package is like a giant library full of DLL that many programs rely on. Okay. So but it's important to check your system type before downloading this package. So for that, open the start menu and click on settings. Click on system from the left hand menu. Under system you will find about. Look for the section title system type. This will display whether you have a 64-bit or 32-bit operating systems. And here uh, I am using 64-bit system, you can see. Okay. So now open your favorite web browser and search for Visual C++ redistributable for Visual Studio 2013 package. Now head over to the official Microsoft websites and click on download. And from this page select your system type versions for your system and click on download. When the download is finished, double click the downloaded file to begin the installation process and follow the on-screen instruction to reinstall the package. After the installation is finished, restart your computer and see if the entry point not found error is gone. By following these steps, you should be able to fix the entry point not found error on your Windows 11 computer. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for our channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.